Have you ever wondered about the personal lives of famous philosophers? Well, prepare to have your mind blown as we delve into the untold story of Jean-Jacques Rousseau and D'Alembert. These two intellectual powerhouses may have had differing opinions, but their unique friendship and shared experiences shed light on some of their most profound philosophical ideas. Picture this, it's a beautiful morning in 18th century Paris, and Jean-Jacques Rousseau, the brilliant and controversial philosopher, is strolling through the bustling streets. The city is abuzz with excitement as D'Alembert, the renowned mathematician and philosopher, is about to publish his groundbreaking work, Preliminary Discourse to the Encyclopedia of Diderot. Little did they know that their lives were about to intertwine in the most unexpected ways. Rousseau, known for his passion for nature, finds solace in the quiet corners of the city's parks. As he pens his influential works, such as Discourse on the Origin and Basis of Inequality Among Men, his mind is filled with thoughts on the corrupting influence of society on human nature. This very notion becomes the foundation of his famous concept of the noble savage. Meanwhile, D'Alembert, with his razor-sharp intellect, is grappling with the complexities of knowledge and its dissemination. His work on the Encyclopedia, a revolutionary publication that aimed to compile all human knowledge, challenges the traditional authorities and promotes the idea of free thinking. It is in this pursuit that he becomes acquainted with Rousseau, sparking a friendship that would shape their philosophical endeavors. As the sun sets over the city, Rousseau and D'Alembert engage in passionate debates over wine in the dimly lit cafes. Their discussions revolve around the nature of man, the role of education, and the corrupting influence of society. They both question the prevailing societal norms, challenging the belief that civilization necessarily brings progress and happiness. Rousseau, ever the skeptic, argues that society's artificiality corrupts human nature, advocating for a return to a simpler, more authentic way of life. D'Alembert, on the other hand, champions reason and science as the path to progress and enlightenment. Their spirited conversations fuel their intellectual pursuits and lead to the development of groundbreaking ideas. Through their shared experiences, Rousseau and D'Alembert come to understand that true progress lies in a delicate balance between reason and nature. They realize that society's influence can both uplift and corrupt individuals, and that striking the right harmony is essential for human flourishing. Their friendship, though marked by disagreements and differences, reflects the beauty of intellectual discourse. It is through challenging each other's ideas and embracing diversity of thought that they are able to deepen their own philosophies and make lasting contributions to the world of philosophy. So the next time you find yourself pondering the great philosophical debates of history, remember the unlikely friendship between Rousseau and D'Alembert. Their personal lives and shared experiences shed light on their profound ideas and remind us that true enlightenment often arises from the unlikeliest of connections.